Titanic class first versus second at a windy Sandy Park and we're on the front foot against the wind uh, from the off. Um, a grubber kick by Charlie whereas an inside pass might have opened up a little bit more with Wiggy on the second touchline and again we're probing hard uh, deep into Exeter's defensive third, seven metres from the line and a missed opportunity, a 10 point swing which would have been a try for Ben Ransom ends up being an 80 metre, 90 metre dash for Shorty, who, as we know, having played down at Saracens, isn't short of a set of wheels. A well taken, uh, taken try by Shorty. And if anyone's going to score from the Exeter's team, um, we're happy that it's him. Then from the 22, um, a dubious knock on um, from Whitton's right hand there, um, which they end up getting the try disallowed for, uh, but probably even itself out, given the fact that we were, should have been under the sticks only moments before. And now it's our turn to take the game to Exeter. 11 points down, a series of driving malls. Well worked, you can see here Richard Wigglesworth and Brad Barrett all getting in the action. And Sammy Venisa mussing over for his first, first team try of his career for Saracens. And now with the wind at our backs into the second half. Looking for any opportunity to get closer to the line. Rano doing what he does best, stepping off his left, stepping off his left again and getting caught yards short of the line, earning ourselves a scrum, which was strong throughout the game. Winning as a penalty in this instance, perhaps could have scrummed again, given the dominance that we had, but taking a safe option and going for goal, closing the gap to 11-8. On the attack again, Charlie doing what he seems to be doing quite well at the moment, giving some intercept passes, but a great, Harrowing uh, scrag tackle by Wiggy and good all-round team effort to keep him out from that occasion. 65 minutes in the game, 15 minutes left, last quarter now and again. Attacking deep into Exeter's half. Our game management in the day was pretty epic. Played most of the rugby in Exeter's half. Looking to work the blind side as they have a good fold and good good press, good line speed, earned us the penalty to kick again for goal, drawing the game 11 all. And this is where we've come through in recent weeks, um, despite having a large number of players out, we have a good squad still, a determined squad, one with heart. Um, seeing the game through to the end and with the wind at our backs, looking to Harrow, the likes of Steenson, Chudley. And through that aggressive, Kick pressure, earning ourselves the last penalty of the game to seal a victory, a hard-earned victory on the day.